Hi guys, it's Steve from Disruptive Wealth Creation. Today we look at how disruptive industries are trying to get people out of wheelchairs so that they can walk again. There are three companies we're going to look at. None of them have IPO'd yet, but they are doing some great work. The first one is called Wondercraft. The second one is called Synchron. And the third one is called Neuralink. Check out their progress, timelines and costs. Watch this video and see how the future is going to change our world. We start with a company called Wondercraft, founded in 2012, based in Paris, France, employs 98 people and develops exoskeletons, enabling people to walk without crutches. Let's do that again but in an ordinary environment. Synchron is the second company we are looking at. They will be starting their human trials in 2022 after receiving $50 million in funding. They're based in the United States with 23 employees and recruiting. Their work is probably years away from adoption, but here is what they have to say. Some conditions affecting the nerve cells in the body can result in disability spinal cord injury, stroke, limb amputation, and motor neuron disease, or ALS, may all cause paralysis, or even loss of the ability to speak. The Stentrode is a neural interface designed to overcome paralysis by creating a digital bypass from brain to assistive device. An investigational device, the Stentrode is inserted via a catheter into the jugular vein and maneuvered into the brain without the need for open brain surgery. The sensors are built onto a self-expanding stent that engages into the wall of the vein and which is designed to maintain blood flow. Over time, cells may gradually grow over the sensors and incorporate them into the tissue. The sensors are placed immediately adjacent to the control center in the brain, known as the motor cortex. The patient may be paralyzed, but their motor control center can still be activated simply by thinking. The system is designed to transmit these brain signals out of the brain, out of the vein, and into a unit implanted under the skin in the chest. This unit is programmed to pick up brain signals continuously, and when connected to an external receiver, may send them to a computer. The command center in the brain is now directly connected to software, and the patient would attempt to train their brain for direct operating system control by thinking. Direct brain control of a mouse, a keyboard, exoskeletons and even vehicles may become possible. Technology to restore independence. Synchron's Neural Interface Technology, enabling people. The third and final company we want to look at is Neuralink. Neuralink was founded in 2016 by Elon Musk. The company has over $150 million in funding, 100 million coming directly from Elon Musk himself. It employs around 98 employees. Here is Elon Musk talking about Neuralink. Stay to the end and watch Elon Musk talk to the animals. All right, welcome to the Neuralink product demo. I'm really excited to show you what we've got. I think it's going to blow your mind. It is to solve important spine and brain problems with a seamlessly, seamlessly implant, implanted device. So you want to have a device that you can basically uh, put in your head um, and feel and look totally normal, uh, but it solves uh, some, some important problem um, in your brain or spine. And the reality is that almost everyone uh, over time will develop brain and spine problems. Uh, these range from uh, minor to very severe, but if you live long enough, you, you, everyone's going to 
basically have some kind of um, neurological disorder. So in summary, we have Wondercraft, which offers a exoskeleton, which costs $175,000, but it's likely to get cheaper and more manageable to wear. And you can buy that now. And then you have Synchron and Neuralink, which are years away from being ready uh, to be used by the general public, but are more of a solution rather than just an enabler. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you are new. And let's end with Elon Musk talking to the animals. Thank you. This is a, this is a high energy pig. Um, all right, Gertrude, thanks for coming out. Um, so what you're, the, the beeps you're hearing are real-time signals from the neural link in Gertrude's head. So this neural link connects to neurons that are uh, in her snout. So whenever she snuffles around and touches something with her snout, the, that sends out uh, neural spikes, which are detected here. Um, and so on the screen, um, you can see uh, each, each of the, the spikes from the 1,024 electrodes. And, and then if, you, if, she, yeah, if she snuffles around, touches this out in the ground, or you kind of feed her some food, pigs love food, um, then uh, you, you can see the neurons um, will fire much more than when you're not touching this out. And uh, that's what's making the, the beeping sound.